it's Dr. Jen. And Dr. Steph. Have you noticed that a lot of people are taking pain pills like candy these days? It's scary. Yeah, and I mean, we get it. Like, people don't want to be in pain, but they also don't know that there's an alternative. But some of the side effects and why people want to get off medication, we hear a lot of people that take medication that want to get off of it. Like for narcotics, for example, they show that they're ineffective over time. So they're, they're okay for short-term use, but for a chronic pain, they become inactive. Then people have to take more and more and more and they become addicted. Addicted. Yeah. Yeah. And they can also cause a lot of constipation, bowel issues. So what's another common one? Another common one is ibuprofen. So, so many people take this one thinking, oh, it's, it's innocuous, this can't really hurt me. But in fact, there are over 100,000 hospitalizations every year and 14,000 deaths every year just due to ibuprofen. Not only that, but here's, here's the side effects. It can also cause erectile dysfunction in men in their 20s and 30s. Not only that, bleeding ulcers, gut damage, kidney damage, liver damage from something that people think is just innocuous. And again, over time, it stops working. So people ha end up taking toxic amounts because it stops having its desired effect. And there are yearly limits, there's lifetime limits of these over-the-counter. You can buy these over-the-counter medications, including Tylenol too. Another common one. Yeah, yeah, another common one is Tylenol. And that one, some of the side effects of that is that it causes liver failure causes your lim liver to be damaged over time. So we just want to let you know that there are a lot of different solutions out there, natural solutions to help you get off some of these medications because we know you don't want to take them. And to help you get out of pain. I think that's the biggest thing. People think that they can't, if they stop taking them, they're going to be forever in pain. And that's not true. We've gotten hundreds and thousands actually of people off of pain medications using natural methods, including chiropractic, including lifestyle changes, including diet, and making sure that we're feeding our bodies good food and anti-inflammatory foods and things that won't make you hurt. So we know how to do that without the harmful side effects of those over-the-counter medications. So if you need help, you know what to do. Let us know. Let us know. <laughs> Comment, Comment below. below.